October if everything goes well. What up, what up, coach? MP, we got one heck of a matchup tonight. Yeah, I know. And I can't wait to get out there and go toe-to-toe -to -toe with him, too. Well, I've been working on the whiteboard for the last couple hours. He's trying to figure out how to slow him down. All right, all right. Let me see what you got here. Pretty much, you just need to outplay him. I need you to set the tone for the whole team. They're going to be taking their cues from you, and I'm really counting on you to get the upper hand in all aspects of the game. Well, you know that won't be easy, man. You're talking about one of the best players in this league. Better than you? <laughs> Sorry. No. Not at all. That's what I want to hear. Showcase of the regular season, Christmas Day. Greg, what a special day this has become on the NBA calendar. It's really an honor to get to play in one of these games. Everyone is watching while they open presents or have dinner with their families. This is a lot of fun. And now Lakers starting group. Elias Oba out there with Anthony Davis. Then it's Patrick Beverly. Then it's LeBron James. Here's Zuzu, guarded by Doncic. Over Hardaway, James with the bucket. It's the first good move in a game of chess between these two coaches. Strategy is going to be a big part of the outcome tonight. We'll see which team dictates the style of play. And it's Doncic missing. And it's Davis with the ball for the Lakers. From outside the arc, and LeBron James with the three. LeBron's got five. The defense has to shut LeBron down at the perimeter. He'll sink that shot all night. Doncic outside, unloads, and James pulls it down. Missed opportunity, wide open for mid-range. He would love to get that one back. And the question for the Mavs is simple. How do you best build a... Greg, it just seems for the Mavs, it's all about finding the right fit for the role players. And that's why this team was willing to move on from Porzingis. Going forward, you can see them look a lot like Harden or Rockets. Oh, three throws good from lights out. He's living there tonight, a tough guy to guard without filing the bonus. He's going to knock him down. Bonjic outside. Will it go? Rebound the Lakers. They defeated Charlotte in their last game. Well, it helps when your opponent makes that many mistakes. I thought that was the story of the game. There were some unforced errors, but they also created some mistakes through their intensity on both ends. Right on the bucket. And it doesn't matter if Luka is working on or off the ball. You have to stay connected to him defensively. Here's Davis. Hit from about six feet away. Guys, that's just really a stop. He poses a ton of matchup problems for whomever he's facing. Doncic passes to Finney Smith. Back to Doncic. It's a floater, and the shot goes in. And already in his career, Doncic displays a remarkable amount of pro moves, including that floater right there. And that was the mobile one drive. Well worth a second look. And you gotta love the aggression that he had taking it to the rim there. Sets the tone in a close game like this one.
So timeout called here. The first for Los Angeles. The pick and roll. Incredible to see someone run it to perfection. Here's Davis, and it's Davis with the jam. The awareness of LeBron knows where everyone is on the floor at all times. And here's Doncic from the arc. That ball is in the basket. Now he's shot six and made three of them. And with Doncic in the pick and roll game, he's so good at such a young age. It's amazing how well he reads defense, but he can also freeze the defender or create a confusion with that. Hesitation. He had all the tricks to run. Here's Doncic following the basket by Anthony Davis. And the all around game of Doncic, not just the score, but a great dime dropper as well. Notices his open teammates quickly. Here's lights out. And again, it's the Lakers from deep. And their offense already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this lead. Hardaway against Beverly. And a double up And there's the call on pass. That is first foul. Here's Hardaway. 11 points for him in that last game against Houston. Lock at six. Here's Finney Smith. And how about the interior defense here early on? They have really shut down the middle. That's why you never quit battling on the offensive glass. And that's a nice reward for his effort. Uh, the flush, perfect. Working hard, beating everyone to the ball. He does this night in and night out. Now here's LeBron against Charlotte. He was really on his game. Davis with a screen on green. He was all alone on that one. LeBron's got seven points. Mavericks trail by seven. Stolen. One on one here. Here's Davis. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. He's got eight. In case anyone was wondering, this is what it looks like when you're in the zone. He hasn't missed one all quarter. Outside Hardaway. Pass to Finney Smith. On the putback. Just in a perfect position to grab that rebound and then get the putback. Los Angeles leading by seven. Uzo, the pass to Ilias Sova. They set the pick. A chance there to push it to double digits, but it's off the mark. To the middle. Here's Doncic. And Doncic throws it down. Slammed down by Doncic. A monster in the back court at 6 7. Uzo dishes to Ilias over. From 11 feet away, and the Lakers check on two more. And that pick takes the D totally out of the equation. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Here's Doncic. Scores after the quick crossover. They're still behind, but not because of his efforts. He's been unbelievable this quarter. Win against James. The dish dues. Launches it. Good, and the assist goes to James. Eight points for lights out. And he likes to get in a rhythm early. Triple. Now, here's Doncic. He's covered closely. Outside Hardaway. To the paint. Here's McGee. And it's McGee with the jam. <laughs> Both teams racking up the points to start this game. Then you wonder how long they can keep it going. At some point, you expect the defense will adjust. You won't find a much better value partner. AD flying to the rim.
Here's Hardaway. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. Donjic outside. And the Mavericks getting another bucket right there. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now. Especially on the interior. James, the best of Davis. Over Green. And Davis gets out on the assist pull of front. Davis has got 12. Even when AD can't get inside, he's got options. He's got the touch from the mid-range. Outside Hardaway. Doncic looking it over. Unloads from 13. That one is no good. He is 6 for 11 in the game. Davis dishes to Huza. And the pass to LeBron. And finished off by LeBron. Boy, that was quick. Already out to a double-digit lead. This has been a beatdown right here. Possibly over before it began. And so Doncic will bring it up for Dallas. It's a 10-point game. It's deflected and stolen by James. Here's lights out. Finish off the break. 10 points for him. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stat for the Lakers. They've been going after steals in this game. It has been super impressive. They are wreaking havoc right now. Out hustled the opponent so far in this one. A lot of points in the open floor, and that's giving them the advantage. Sinks the three pointer. Yeah, we're seeing some fireworks from them already. They established the pace, they made shots. This is why they're way out in front. Now, here's Doncic. 13 points in the game. And here's Green outside, kept alive. McGee. That one goes in for him, too, making it look easy. He's now four for four. At the end of the day, when the ball goes up, there's no substitute for effort. James looking around. It's Beverly on the wing. And again, it's the Lakers from deep. And you can't help but pick their defense apart. They're completely in disarray. Dallas calls timeout. Yes, and peace. Oh, enough. really? That's enough in the world. Wiggle? So for the right now, that's really out there with lights out. And there's Davis. Then it's Ilya Silva. And it's James with the spot. Here's lights out. Gets the three pointer to fall. Lights out's got 16. And you can tell he's looking for his shot. He just believes in it. You know why? Success breeds confidence. And he's certainly been successful from there time and time again. And now the latest from our reporter, David Aldridge. Hey, guys. Lights out in their last game against Charlotte just was phenomenal. He had 42 points, and he got those points as he always does, knocking down shots from beyond the arc. It's rare to see any player put up numbers like that. It's likely a game he'll always remember. Kevin? Thanks, David. Greg, it was obvious. He was having a lot of fun out there. Tremendous victory. I'll tell you, he may have been enjoying himself, but whoever was matched up against him certainly wasn't. What I like is they just kept calling his number. Sometimes we see coaches go away from what's working, and we wonder why. They set the screen, and that one's good, James. And they're getting their points now almost exclusively from the triple. Four of their last five makes are from beyond the arc. Here's Green. And the assist goes to Dunchich. Man, you gotta respect Luka's passing skills. Uh, just a multi-talented player who is all about sharing the basketball. And Uzo wing shot on the way. And the Lakers tack on two more. He has created some terrific opportunities for himself and really made the most of them. 
some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now, you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Here's Doncic. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Davis has got four rebounds in the team. A slight rebound advantage for them. One more column in their favor, and it's all adding up. Beverly for three, and another three for the Lakers. Yeah, great outside shooting, really fueling this run. Well, and for Anthony Davis, a big contributor to this team when healthy. Kevin A.D. does everything on the court that you ask of him. He can defend talent. When you think of half-court offenses in general, Greg, how critical is ball and player movement to a team's success? Kevin, unless you have incredible isolation scores, it's essential. Yeah, even then, keeping the defense rotating and For Dallas, they've gotten just over 50% of shots to drop here in the second quarter. They're 5 for 9. No one near Doncic as he lets it fly. And he's good on the field ball. Doncic has got 18 points. Here's lights out. 6 for 6. He's yet to miss from the field. And how about the performance we're seeing from him? Not one miss on the day. Left side, Hardaway. Over Beverly, and Hardaway gets it to go. Los Angeles is going to sublime four of four three-point range since we've been here in the second quarter. Here's Davis, again the Lakers. I love the assertive play from Anthony Davis so far, refusing to back down on the offensive end. And here's Doncic from the arc. Hits it from three-point range. Doncic has got a couple of three-pointers in the second for the man. And here's LeBron outside. And the Lakers hit again from deep. Flexing the range. LeBron too competitive to let the last three go unanswered. Outside green. Shot from the wing. The shot will not fall. And the Lakers will go the other way with it. And this is the time they matched up with the Mavericks. Well, these two teams will see plenty of each other as this is the first of four contests between them this year. They know each other very well, and they'll be getting to know each other a lot better by him. Donjic outside. Let's a floater go, and the layup is up and in. Donjic has got 10 points now just in this quarter. Taking things into his own hands this quarter. Trying to keep his team afloat. And he pulls off the Houdini to bake that catch and slam it through. Stupendous alley-oop. Now, Donjic... False name. Pass to McGee. Takes it from 10. And it's Doncic. That time on the assist by McGee. Doncic has got 25 points in the game. Here's Zuzi. He's got 21. Drops in the tray. Riding the hot hand. And why not? If something's working, keep going to it. Donchich outside. Out left to the wing. Here's Wood. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. And two free throws coming up on it. To show he can be a winner as well. Good on the second free throw. And you're about impacting win. How does Wood, Greg, take the next step in that regard? Well, Kevin, we know he can make shots. And block shots. That's consistency and decision-making. And, and then defensively, I think he's more than capable. 
Doncic passes to Wood. Throws down the alley-oop slam. And let the big man eat. Throw it up to Wood, and he'll complete that. Out to the wing. Here's Ilyasova. In good for a second. He's made two or three so far. And, and those are the kinds of plays that are just killing them right now. Hard away against Beverly. They get the rebound, and it's McGee with the jam. And able to pad his stats a little bit there on that play, the board and the bucket. And you know, Greg, that'll put him in the good graces of that coaching <laughs> staff, too. My goodness. Oh, a guy as big as LeBron can handle the ball that well is a mystery. And so Dondich will bring it up for the Dallas Mavericks. Now the feed to McGee, and just sends it back. Ilya Sobich is Duza. Hard away against LeBron. Lays it up and banks it in. James has got 23 points. Though LeBron loves to keep his teammates involved, when he's spilling it, like tonight, he'll call his own number. Green against LeBron. Donchich outside. 27 points for him. In this period, they're feeding him, and he's feeling it. A three ball, and again, it's the Lakers from deep. Yeah, and he made three three-pointers in the first quarter, and he just continued to pour them on here in the second. Inside, and a dunk by Dajic. A great disruptor of the basketball. Look at taking matters into his own hands tonight. Great to see him play like this. Wasted no time on that one. And that's now 30 points for lights out. They've given up a lot of three-pointers here today. McGee a screen. Hardaway passes to McGee. Doncic kicks to Hardaway. Shot clock at six. And here's Doncic from the arc. Lakers with the rebound. Ilyasova's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Uzo, the best to LeBron. Good. Nice job down low. What a game for him so far. He started out strong in that first quarter and has only turned it up from there. Dallas has gone two of four from three-point range so far in the second quarter. This is it to make... On the wing, Doncic. He has 29. McGee, the pass would. Beyond the arc. Buries it from three-point range. Woods got six here in this quarter. Here in the second quarter, he's looking much more comfortable with his offense. Uzo dishes to Davis. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. In the corner, Ilya Sova with it. There's a good screen. Trying to get open is Davis, and it's Ilya Sova with the three. Ilya Sova's got seven. They're, they're getting a lot of their points outside the paint. Three of their last five baskets are from three point range. And they keep hammering away inside, forcing the ball into the paint. Fires from deep. And the last second attempt does not go in for him. And it's just encouraging to see Lucas step up. So as we conclude the first half, so far fairly one sided. Los Angeles on up, delivering the blowout. And we'll get going after this from the American Airlines Center. Hey there, everybody. Shaq says hi. Kenny says hi, too. Yes, we are in the midst of the NBA season and a perfect time to see how things are coming together in the West. You're taking a look at the Lakers. They've absolutely risen to the occasion this season. People are talking up their game early, and so far, they've delivered. 
Now it's time to finish strong, show no weakness. And guys, huge surprise. LeBron with a great first half. They've been dialing his number, and he's answered the calls. His teammates know he's feeling it. Credit them for being unselfish and getting him the ball. Feed him every position. The dog is hungry. You know about big dogs being hungry, man. You are big today, even today. That's all for us. Now it's time to send it back to Kevin Harlan for the beginning of the third quarter. And we welcome you back to NBA Action, a great tradition, Christmas Day basketball, here on UK Sports. You know, Luka Doncic has been exceptional, guys. Well, through the first two, he has been nothing short of a marksman for me. What can you say? Shooting is a premium in this league, and you can see why. Inside form, it'll be Finney Smith and McGee. At the guard positions, it's Doncic and Hardaway Jr., and it's green in at the small forward position. That's the five to begin the second half for Jason Kidd. Beverly, the pass to Uza. Back to Beverly. Which is a three. Good from long range. Beverly's got the first points of the second half here for the Lakers. Yeah, that's two straight three-pointers they've allowed. There's a screen. Doncic kicks to Hardaway. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. And with the success they've had rebounding the basketball, they're right where you'd expect them to be, firmly in the driver's seat. I just love watching Davis go to work inside. This is too easy for him. On the wing, Hardaway. Fed by Beverly. Doncic with it. He has 31. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. And he's frustrated. That's a shot he can make in his sleep. And with an update from the sidelines, let's check in with David Aldridge. Thanks very much. Now, from the step back to his attacking style, some have compared Luka Doncic to the beer, James Harden. There are some similarities, Harden said. Being able to dictate and control the game like he does, he never lets anyone speed him up, and he gets what he wants. Back to you, Kevin. He always says they're both pretty fun to watch. David, thank you. This is what AD gives you at that end. He's made the all-defensive first team multiple times. Oh, great ball move there. And so Doncic will bring it up for Dallas. Searching for that first bucket here in the third. Hardaway with a wide open look. The shot's good on the assist by Doncic. Hardaway has got five points so far. And they get one. Now one of five here in the third. Uzo, the pass to LeBron. There's the feed to Davis. And it's Davis finishing it off. Well, now that they've set into this game, you can see the offense is firing on all cylinders. Yeah, the reason why they made the just eight, they are executing. Dallas has gone one of three from downtown since halftime. Three minutes gone now in the third quarter. Down low, and stolen by LeBron. Fast break, the Lakers. Loads it up for Davis. Can't complete the alley-oop. For Dallas, they've gone only 1-5 from the field since that time. A very slow start offensively. To the inside, and stolen by James. Going inside. Savvy ball movement by Anthony Davis, making good use of his floor vision.
And that's now. And here is Hardaway. He has five. Dodgers outside. Over Davis. Drills the baseline jumper. Doncic has got 33. He has gotten into a terrific groove here, trying to wheel his team back into this. He gets that one. And they've had assists now on their last three baskets. Here's Hardaway. And you can see his score totals. Those are some pretty good numbers. He's putting up close to 15 points a game on average. He kicks it to Green. Doncic outside. The nine-foot shot. Good. Great play by Green to set it up. 35 points for Luka Doncic. Here's Uza. He's got 34. Davis with a screen on Doncic. James dishes to Davis. Six to shoot. And that one's good. Beverly. Even though he's more the size of a point guard, Patrick Beverly's better off ball than initiating. And with the struggles he has had to stay healthy, and you wonder, though, if the team's going to focus on having him be at his best for that postseason run and, and try to manage the wear and tear. They have been board dominant in this game. That's definitely been a factor in crafting this huge lead. Hardaway passes to Finney Smith. Banked in off the glass. Finney Smith got six. Great to set your man up with a high percentage look. And Davis is on the for Greg. He is a force. But how do you keep him healthy into the playoffs? That is the question. I mean, sustaining his output over a full season isn't easy. But Davis has had a bit of bad luck with the injuries. So you have to mitigate ways to keep him available. It has been a real difference in this one. Taking what the defense has given, and it's been paying off. And another area they've separated themselves has been their three-point shooting. Making the defense pay for any airspace. Catching up on the changes for Dallas. Powell, he's jacked in for JaVale McGee. Pertinus comes in for Josh Green. And it's Reggie Bullock in for Hardaway. And showing he's got a few tricks up his sleeve there. Doncic's handles are very impressive. And the foul called on Anthony Davis. That is his first foul of the game. Pick it. And so are the Lakers taking care of business here. A resounding victory for them. And Greg in enemy territory, no less. See, that's exactly right. But with the way they controlled the game and, and just completely took the crowd out of it, that's how to get it done on the road. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Steve Smith, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in. We'll see you next time.